Hey. Wait for me. I have little legs. Yesterday, or a couple days ago, there was an all call put out for a BMX jam. And considering that I have passed the antibodies test and tested negative for the virus itself and the nasal swab, I'm gonna go on a BMX jam. I do have to do a few things first, which is I have to extend the pins on my pedals a little bit, put some chain lube on. I was gonna try and swap the rear gear ratio because if you've ever tried to keep up with a BMX jam on a child's bike, you know that that's funny for everyone except for you. I'm not quite able to do that, but I'm just gonna drive and meet them like halfway through the jam anyway, because um, I'm not about to ride over the Brooklyn Bridge for fun. I agree. I wholeheartedly agree. Oh wow, there's stuff in these. Oh, that's a one more five. Cool. Okay. Cool. It's back. If you're wondering, this is what I use. Do I know why? Not really, but that's never stopped me before. everything in and go meet up with Brandon. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and go straight to Manhattan because I think the uh, jam is in Brooklyn right now. Sick, fully prepared, awesome. All right, got gas, uh, head to the spot. Brandon's already there. And I'm gonna park a little closer to it. I was gonna park in Chelsea before, but that's still too far away. So I'm gonna go with Soho and see what my luck is finding parking there. Let's see what FIFOS has in limp mode. That is just terrible. <laughs> that's so sad. Oh, hello. This place is empty. What the? It's so weird. It seems like a small town almost. Where are they? All right, so we got a little bit of an awkward situation. Either, I couldn't quite tell over the phone, but I either Chad or one of Chad's friends, and that's the guy setting this up, just broke his arm, so they're running a little bit late. But Brandon uh, is on his way back over, and so I'm just gonna warm up here, I guess, while they show up. I'm feeling, got the antibodies, life is good, yeah, didn't really? die. It's good, bro. This thing looks like a, wow. Like how does the e-bike 
It's a pedal resistance. It got three different modes. So you just pedal and it just makes it, it just adds as Basically, you pedal? Basically, yeah. Whoa, it's what the, the motor right here down here is the battery and the down to it. I so, gotta try it. Uh, I just want to like make sure I don't loop out instantly. Just like give a pedal and go. Nah, <laughs> it, 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 it got a kick, but you know, you, you'll get the hang of it. Is that the drop post? Yeah, drop a seat post. Oh, is it this? Yeah, that button right there. Oh, that's so much better. I have like the, the plunger. Yeah. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> oh! Okay, that's weird, right? That is cool. Is it it's not doing anything right now, right? Oh, no. Nah. Cool. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. See a difference, right? Whoa. <laughs> that's kind of. Strange feeling. It's pedal resist, that's why. Oh. You gotta kick on turbo mode. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it definitely has a battery in there. Yeah, hell yeah. Ah. Nice one. Yeah. Nice one. You blessing my bike right now, watch me. Okay. Okay. Learn something new today. Hey. Bro, this thing's kind of freaky, but I guess once you get used to it, it's probably like tons of fun. No, nah, yeah, of course. Hell yeah. So wait, what, is Chad the one that broke his arm or someone else? Nah, not Chad. Oh, okay. He's one of his close friends. So. Gotcha. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> oh wait, I can film on this now. Oh, man. So there's a guy on Instagram that I follow named Seth. Seth Stevens, do you follow him? Seth, yeah. He's from like, bugging, yeah. Yeah, he, he, too. he does some dumb shit on things. Oh, shit, sorry. I'm the scooter kid. So I guess we're gonna try and meet up. The group is probably gonna, yeah. Group's gonna skip some spots, and we're gonna catch him at uh, the vessel. I'm about to die pedaling, standing up with one hand, trying to film stuff. So I'm gonna put you in my pocket and see you when we get somewhere. My man keeps forgetting I'm on a child's bike. I can only go eight miles an hour, man. Showing off your electric skis, mobile. He just goes so fast. It's kind of dope. I don't know if you can see any of it. Oh. Co corona what? Oh my lord. How slow can you all? Oh. Brandon over here like, yeah bro, I'll give you a push, I'll give you a push, get ahead of me. And then start pedaling away. What's up, brief interlude from the future. I'm currently on a road trip in Virginia heading south. And I wanted to explain some things in this video between the last clip that you saw and the one that you're about to see because it's really confusing if you weren't there. I decided to stop recording after the last clip you saw because I knew that I already had a lot for the day and just wait until we found the jam. The only problem was we never found the jam. We went on for like another two and a half hours we made it to the vessel, no one was there. We went to Times Square, we waited for like another half hour, no one showed up. And uh, we just gave up at Times Square. Brandon lives uptown, so we started heading uptown and my car was downtown, so I started heading downtown. Made it a block south and ran straight into the jam. So I joined in, uh, that ended up going somewhere around Chinatown to an ice cream shop that Chad had an arrangement with. And then we pick up from there and that's the next clip that you're gonna see. So I just wanted to fill that gap in because it's really confusing if you didn't know what happened. Um, but with that, let's get back into it. All right. So we found the group uh, literally 30 seconds after Brandon dipped. That's not too bad. I think everyone stopped for ice cream and then to shop is after this or maybe another spot. 
But I'm gonna drink these because I'm dying. The goat has returned. Nice right. camera, man. Thanks, man. It's been through a little bit. Literally just dropped it as I was pulling it out of my pocket. Uh, I'm gonna text the guy early to, like next week to see like when I'm gonna get my bike back. Yeah. Dope. Marcus, for context, because I. Oh, you want ice cream? You're getting free ice cream. What? Chad, you're getting free ice cream for everyone. Chad, getting free ice cream? But I... Yeah. Damn, I don't usually eat ice cream, but damn. <laughs> Holy shit. Adrian's not gonna fucking believe this. There's I no way. Sam? Yes, yeah, Sam. <laughs> I think I recognize you. Oh my this, god. That is insane. <laughs> so, I don't know if I've. I, I think on YouTube I've explained this. My roommate's name is Adrian and he makes all of Ryan Sirhan's yeah. vlogs. And they did a challenge What's called up? Free Year NYC. Get someone to move to New York City and then to pay for everything. This is crazy. Like, this is actually crazy. The entire team, they all chose this guy unanimously. Hey, yo, Sam. <laughs> What's up? What's up? Nick, I won the challenge. What a small fucking world. That's insane. It happens. Dude, so what's the what's up with that? Because I know that they were like, what? No one was expecting the pandemic, I guess. So what's... Um, so I guess like I had to reschedule. I was supposed to move in March 30th, mm -hmm. um, and I rescheduled. I moved in next week. Oh shit! Um, so officially moving in May 30th. Nice. Yeah, super excited. And you, my understanding is that you ran across the country yeah. on recycled plastic shoes to. <laughs> so yeah, just finished running across the U.S. Um, I was running 23 miles a day. That's <laughs> well, 191 days on these shoes, actually. I can't tell you that I've run 23 miles in my entire life. That's why I have this. <laughs> this is bike around, yeah. That's um, insane. Well, good to know you're here. I was so confused. Yeah, you second. looked familiar. I was like... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I've been in New York for a couple days just preparing the move. Um, That's dope. And yeah, it's crazy. I mean, it's so good to find you here. Yeah. So where are you from originally? From France. Oh. Um, from France, then I grew up in Indonesia. And it's quite... And then recently ran across the US. As you do. I think everyone can relate to that. <laughs> <laughs> Every fat kid in sync is struggling right now. What a gent. I'm like from over there. What a gentleman. Class act. Class act. Thank God they all got one. That was close. That was close for a keto boy. Go for it, man. Keep me from breaking myself off trying hop whips over here. Do it for Drew. <laughs> Marcus the trialsy boy. Someone sponsored this man. Someone sponsored this man. Well, so okay, maybe not. Someone sponsored me. Oh my god, that's such a high me. <laughs> you miss it yet? Yeah. Good to that. Very good. I got it higher on the phone though. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Damn, I got that one whip. <laughs> oh, I'm in the way. Right. I'm not catching it. Like, hey! Whoa! Can I do Oh shit. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm always like the scooter kid. I never mean to be, but I'm like, <laughs> I feel so bad. I get close by. That's nice. That's good. Yeah. That's tasty. Very well made. Oh my. I'm gonna try a hot loop. I'm not gonna land one, but I'm gonna try. <laughs> See how close I am. Oh my god. Oh, that shit was clean. Oh. You just gotta help me, huh? Oh. Oh my 
god. Man, I'm on hop with so bad now. Every time I see one actually happen in real life, I'm like, bro. Every time. Oh! I think I'm gonna head to the, the shop soon. Good to see you, bro. Yeah, man. Hopefully, I want to come out. I want to. Um, I think Dan should be back in town sometime soon. Yeah, I want to get my bike back. I hope I get it back this week. Bro, this jam was fancy. People got ice cream and shit. Oh, boy. Oh. 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 Greetings, sir. I think I'm going to head to the shop. Bye, man. The myth. The legend. No, no. No? Back to home. The road. What's good, boy? How you doing, man? I'm doing. I got the antibodies. You good? That's all right, man. <laughs> you know how we doing it. No COVID on this side, man. <laughs> Been doing good? Yeah, man. I'm chilling. You know? So there's a car in a bit. Catch up. And I think I'm going to call out a successful day. Almost thought we lost the boys, but... We found him on accident after we lost one of them. So yeah, thanks for watching you guys. <laughs> you know how this goes. Bad at outros. I'll see you in the next one.